What's going on guys here with another video and today's video is actually probably gonna be my favorite thing so I have some packages here and it's all for a siete so quick story um, I am gonna airbag her airbag we are gonna airbag the truck so um, I wasn't planning on doing it anytime soon but I was on Instagram and then I realized I saw a post that of Accuer. I follow Accuer on Facebook. I saw a post where they're um where they were announcing that they were gonna close. So uh, I was like, I gotta jump on it and get all the my air management system because Accuer is hands down the best product ever for airbagging shit. So um, today our final pieces came in. So. It's gonna be, I'm gonna be unboxing it on video for you guys. I'm really, really excited for this because it's one of the last products that, um, of AccuAir because they stopped, they closed down. So obviously they're not making them no more. And uh, it was really tough to try and get our hands on these parts. So I'm excited to reveal them with you guys. So let's get started. So right here, this is a, <coughs> This is the wire for the Accuair touchpad, E, e plus, E level, okay? This connects to your ECU, and this connects to your, this is got a razor blade right here. I'm guessing this is a remote, by the shave. Accurate E level. I was trying to get that Accurate E level plus remote touchpad. So this connects to right there. You could connect it, mount that up real good, real nice. Or you could mount it, connect it down here. Mount that up, carry it. It's nice, compact size. It's really good. So you you have your three presets, and you could uh set these at whatever presets you want usually it's like cruise level your normal ride height and then if you see a bump higher or all aired up and then obviously you have a control for every button every bag i mean individually and then you have both that both front both rear so it's actually pretty cool i like this i really like this it's obviously nickel plated So, like I said, we're, I was trying to get the E-Level touchpad plus, E-Level plus touchpad. Only difference is, like, the wire's already connected on there, so it moves, it swivels, and then uh, it indicates if your compressor is on or off. There's that, and then, you see this is the, you see this is the ECU. Ooh, Accurate. This is your registration. This is your serial number. But obviously, see that's the E level plus touchpad. Only difference is it indicates your compressor. But that one works. Obviously, Accurate is closed, so there's no warranty, so we won't be needing this. But it's, it's always good to save. Who needs this? But, wow, check it out guys. This is an E-Level Plus. This is the newest one they came up with. They came out with. So these are the brains. You obviously connect all your things up here. You connect your controller, which is this one. Mounts right there. <clears throat> or it could be this one. I don't know, they're both the same. Oh no, actually they're not. Oh, the tabs change. See, these tabs, this one's more up. Okay, anyways, there's this, guys. And then you have two screws. Comes with some hardware right there. So you, you can either mount it standing up, or you could, uh, if there's these four screws, you can mount it facing up. It's up to you, but, wow, I'm excited. So this, they just came up with this one and, and um, they were gonna release the app 
the app was going to be released towards the end of March, but since they closed down, they weren't able to release it. But I've talked to an engineer, his name Ryan, shout out to Ryan. So I talked to the engineer and he said that the app was like 99% complete. So hopefully once all this COVID-19 settled, I hope that we could, uh, I hope they could release the app because everything was set. All they had to do was run it through like iOS and Android. So I don't know how that works, but he said it was 90% done and it's 90% done. But so that's why we have to use a touchpad for now. Cause the E-Level Plus, once they release the app, you're able to control it through your phone via Bluetooth. So that's what this is for. Okay, and then before we continue, I want to give a huge shout out to Armin from Euro Turning. Tuning, he was a really big help. I don't know too much about air management systems, so he helped me out a lot. He helped me understand what everything does. And he was able to track down a lot of parts for me and build the kit because they everywhere was sold out, everywhere, everywhere. So he was able to create a kit for me. He was able to track down parts from different companies and like build the whole kit so huge shout out to him i really appreciate it man and they're up in tampa florida <clears throat> euro turn <coughs> good company a lot of suspension parts and stuff or like cars this is Tito. Okay. We have box number one. Box number two. Okay, nothing else. So Honestly. I've never imagined this day would come. There's the E level. The manuals. Wow, look how nicely packaged this is. You have your phone. This is okay, guys. So, this is your this, for my understandings, is the same thing as the E Level Plus. These are called like the ECUs, but see how they have the same connections. So, these are like the brains, like, this is the this is the latest model. So you could run either or. Okay, so there's this. I don't really need this, but it's always good to have extra. Okay, there is a package for this. Yep, four corner control kit. Awesome. <clears throat> Acura is definitely badass, man. I, I'm actually pretty sad they closed. We got some screws. Do you want to screw Tito? Then right here, okay. This has to be a sensor. One of the pressure sensors. Yep. It's a 200 PSI pressure sensor. I'm not going to open that. You know what a sensor looks like. And this... I have no idea what this is. <laughs> um, yeah, I don't know what this is. I'm gonna need to read the manual. Uh, let me see, let me see, let me see. That's a fuse. Another fuse. I think, I'm guessing this is like your power source. Okay. 
this connects there. Okay, that connects there, but I'm not sure what this is. I don't know yet. We'll find out. Okay, we got that, and then these are your. Before your sensors, I know you like your level sensors, your position sensors. I don't know what the rods, I don't know. And this is a harness for your sensors. So there's four sensors. Okay, two in the front, two in the back. There's your connection. That goes to your ECU. This is, I don't know. I don't know what this is. I'll find out. Okay, there's a razor blade. Okay, these are just, this is just like some hardware, some screws. Let's see what these, all these are. Yeah. <clears throat> yeah, all these are hardware screws. I'm guessing for the sensors. I may be wrong. Okay, and there's four of these, so I'm guessing these are the sensors. Okay, yep. These are your sensors. So this is these where are those? These go to those. So these go to your truck, I believe. So whenever this lives, it tells you your position and that's why I, I think this is why Acura is really good too because you have your adjusters adjusted um, heights. So automatically when you turn your truck off, it'll air all the way out. You, when you turn it on, it'll go to your right height. So these are really badass. Okay, there's four of them. <clears throat> Excited. This truck is going to be badass when we're done. This first, and then this, and then this. I don't know. Just sensor. This is your thing, and then this is your ECU. Cover back up. Bagging my truck pretty soon. This is a VX4. Oh yeah. Check this out, guys. That's your uh, it's called your manifold or your solenoid. I thought this thing was smaller. This thing is sweet. Okay. Um, that looks like the same switch that was there. I could be wrong. Let's see. This is your ground. And I'm guessing this is your battery. I don't know. Then I don't know what the heck this is. Check it out, guys. That is so sweet. This is why Acura is the best. <coughs> yeah, there's an instruction manual. Is that for your, I guess, your tank and all your fitments, all your airlines and stuff so that's that and that is a wrap well 
there you have it guys um thank you once again for watching our videos subscribing to them make sure you guys like and subscribe and stay tuned for the build we're, we're still working on the bed we're still working we recently just took the fenders off and cut them up so we'll keep you guys updated on the whole build i just wanted to make a quick video on, on showing you guys the, the next thing that's gonna happen with silver auto i really appreciate y'all i really appreciate armin from euro tuning appreciate accurate they make some really dope products it's sad that they closed down but you know what like hopefully they make a comeback they're, it's a really big nice company i'm sure they're gonna someone else will buy them and hopefully they release the app too so stay tuned guys and thank you guys keep liking and subscribing make sure you guys share with your friends if you guys have any questions please reach out to us and we should be uploading a video here pretty soon i finally got the logo so We'll make sure and share that with you guys. Thank you once again. Deuces.